Charlie the Pope Final. Pope Final, Pope Charlie. Bismillah. Oh, <coughs> so everybody, this is uh, just uh, another upload of one of my flights. I'm currently completing the CPL, um, and this flight that you're about to see is the CPL uh, BIFM module, which is the Basic Instrument Flying Module. It's also part of the Instrument um, Rating Module. So what you'll see here is um, a flight in Poland um, going from Echo Papa Papa Oscar, which is the, the uh, international airport based in Poznan, be going from Poznan to uh, fly some instrument um, approaches at an aerodrome called Zielona Gora. Um, now, what we'll be doing is flying to the VOR at Zielona Gora on uh, frequency 11065. Uh, once we reach the fix, we'll do left-hand holding patterns, which are non-standard. And I'll be, if I'm coming from the northeast, it will be a direct entry. So you get to the fix, commence the rate one turn, head outbound 065. Once you beam uh, the fix, you would then... Um, switch on your stopwatch or your timer on your Garmin 1000 or whatever device you're using. You start a timer, hold out, so continue outbound for one minute and then commence a turn back to intercept the radial two or the radial that goes to the fix or the radial that comes from the fix, should we say, to be more accurate. So you intercept that radial and make your way back to the fix. Right, so you do as many patterns as you need to. That's um, now when you're ready to make your approach. Once you pass the fix again, you continue. You, you repeat your rate one turn, outbound zero six five. But instead of just going outbound for one minute, you stretch it out to in this case seven point four dme or seven point four miles from the VOR. Once you once you reach seven point four, you commence your turn and intercept the localizer back to the VOR. Uh, prior to reaching the final approach fix, you would configure the aircraft with the landing gear down and perhaps uh, the initial stage or approach phase of the flaps. And if, there's, if you're not using an ILS, in this case, I've done a few approaches, one with ILS, one with uh, VOR localizer, and one with um, RNP, RNAV, okay, which is GPS coordinates. So this, basically you configure your aircraft for the glide slope. Okay, if you're using ILS, you follow the uh, localizer and the glide slope on your instrument display. But without a, an ILS approach, just using a VOR localizer, you're going to be calculating based on your distance, your altitude at so you'll, you'll take checkpoints along the way. At six miles, you should be this height. At five miles, you should be this height, uh, etc. On Well, altitude, actually, not, not heights, to be specific. And then you do, once you do your, once I'll be coming down towards the runway, I'll, I'll either do a touch and go or I'll go around and then do a go around procedure, which means continue straight out with a right turn and back to the fix where I enter a hold again. Now, if you're coming from, if you're entering the hold again from that direction, then you'd more than likely be doing an offset entry, which means you reach the fix and then you come out um, on a heading of 095, okay, 095 for a minute, and then you come back round again, intercepting the radial. Make your way, making your way back to the VOR. All right, so let's have a look at the actual performance. So here's the flight. You can see I took her from uh, the International Airport of Poznan, went out to the west, went down to Argelonogoro, oh, came from the northeast, done a couple of holds, done a missed approach, a couple of approaches and then returned back to Poznan and uh, landed. Okay, so let's have a look at the flight and uh, let me know if you have any questions. Thank you.
Hier op een van Matali, hoe een zeiboel toen had gaan om je een tweede kleur voor take off. Hij wil mij twee kleur voor take off, hier op een van Matali. Hier op een Close the window, please. Yes, so every lights, external lights on, flaps. Yes, this, this, this. And the oil is a little bit swinging. And up. Yeah. And ready to go. Yes.
Kibos, Pogorus. Kibos, 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 Zdarzenia będziemy mogli tylko zahaczać o CPR Babiego Mostu, czy akcyzm, bo na razie nic nie odpowiadają. Ratownik Kraszy na pos. Kolejna dwa. QNH 10-14. CTR Zielonej Góry jest nieaktywny. Z tym, że w tej chwili tam mam yy, Tyknona, który robi... Yy, Kolejna dwa. Kolejna dwa. Kolejna dwa. Kolejna dwa. Kolejna dwa. Kolejna dwa. Kolejna dwa.